If you have three or more risk factors for heart disease or stroke, your doctor may say you have what's called metabolic syndrome. Here are the risk factors. A large waistline, high triglycerides, unhealthy cholesterol levels, high blood pressure, and of course, high blood sugar. The good news is that we can control and even reverse metabolic syndrome. Here's how. Eat healthier. Get more fruits and vegetables into your diet. Cut back on salt, sugar, and fat. A body in motion stays in motion. Exercise every day. Just a half hour of walking can make a huge difference. Lose weight if you need to. Your waistline should be less than 35 inches for a woman and less than 40 inches for a man. Work with your doctor to get your numbers in the good range. If you need medications, take them as prescribed. And if you smoke, forget it. Millions of people have kicked the habit, and you can too. Metabolic syndrome is your body's way of telling you to take action now for a longer, healthier life. Get cardio smart. If you have three or more risk factors for heart disease or stroke, your doctor may say you have what's called metabolic syndrome. Here are the risk factors. A large waistline, high triglycerides, unhealthy cholesterol levels, high blood pressure, and of course, high blood sugar. The good news is that we can control and even reverse metabolic syndrome. Here's how. Eat healthier get more fruits and vegetables into your diet. Cut back on salt, sugar, and fat. A body in motion stays in motion. Exercise every day. Just a half hour of walking can make a huge difference. Lose weight if you need to. Your waistline should be less than 35 inches for a woman and less than 40 inches for a man. Work with your doctor to get your numbers in the good range. If you need medications, take them as prescribed. And if you smoke, forget it. Millions of people have kicked the habit, and you can too. Metabolic syndrome is your body's way of telling you to take action now. For a longer, healthier life, get cardio smart. Metabolic syndrome is a name for a group of risk factors that occur together and increase the risk for coronary artery disease, stroke, and type 2 diabetes. Metabolic syndrome is becoming more and more common in the United States. Researchers are not sure whether the syndrome is due to one single cause, but all of the risks for the syndrome are related to obesity. Metabolic syndrome symptoms extra weight around your waist, central or abdominal obesity, increased blood pressure, high blood sugar level, high cholesterol doubt. Metabolic syndrome treatment. The goal of treatment is to reduce your risk of heart disease and diabetes. Your doctor will recommend lifestyle changes or medicines to help reduce your blood pressure, LDL cholesterol, and blood sugar. Recommendations include lose weight get 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise 
lower your cholesterol using weight loss, exercise, and cholesterol-lowering medicines, if needed. Lower your blood pressure using weight loss, exercise, and medicine, if needed. Some people may need to take daily low-dose aspirin. People who smoke should quit. Metabolic syndrome is a common disease, yet every individual needs unique treatment and care. We encourage people with metabolic syndrome and their families to learn as much as possible about the latest medical treatment and approaches as well as healthy lifestyle choices. For more information about metabolic syndrome and how to treat metabolic syndrome, just click on the link at description. Or visit www.mainmd.com. Thank you.